Hello everyone, this is Devil's here, and today I am going to be doing a top five phobias that I have. Yeah, I wanted to connect, I wanted you guys to know what kind of person I am, so, yeah. So, I'm starting out with this, I might do a couple more videos like this, also. That, right there, is a trilobite from Prometheus. That other one is just, this, is, I don't know why I have it hanging there, it's just the thing that came out, and that was on the back of the box. Um, so, anyways, let's get started, shall we? Number five, Scotophobia. Now, this is the fear of darkness here. Um, yes, I do have a fear of the dark, don't judge me. Uh... Honestly, I do not have any of this scripted. I'm just, you know, improvising. I'm a terrible improviser. Uh, so, yeah, scotophobia. It's the fear of dark. Yeah, darkness. Yeah, okay. That's really... It's not really... It's honestly... There are a couple of reasons. It, like, wasn't... It's not... It wasn't always that bad of a thing. Like, until I, uh, saw the trailer for, what was it called, Lights Out. God, that was terrifying. This I don't even want to talk about it. Alright, so, and then, uh, and then, yeah, it's just my mind playing tricks on me. On the next on the list, number four, Lilipsophobia. I believe that is the fear of tornadoes and hurricanes. Yay, Trying to make sure. Alright. So, um. Yep, Lolipsophobia. Yeah. Honestly, I've never been in a situation where a tornado has been passing extremely close to my house. I've never actually seen a tornado in real life. It's just horrific to know, like, that there is this giant twisting. Um, and there's this giant twisting, just, ball of, ball? What the heck? Are, um, just, this cylinder, this cone of just dirt, pieces of buildings and such, and just extreme winds is just, just darting after you. Yeah. On number three, I have astrophobia, the fear of thunder. Yeah, you guys may not, um, this is not as weird as the fear of dark, though, the fear of darkness. Now, I have a little, the reason I keep looking up at my screen is I have a little, uh, uh, notepad up here, but it's just, it's just the same, the number of photo phobias I have, I don't actually have the same scripted at all, I just, anyways, um, so, yeah, so, if I hear even the slightest sound of a thunder, I can distinguish it from jets and thunder and trucks and such, but if I hear it, I, um, my basement, I cannot hear thunder or anything up there, so, unless it's, like, blasting lightning right next to our house, but other than that, I can barely hear it downstairs in my basement. Um, yeah, so, I will dart straight down there. Uh, on number two... Ken, kenamorphophobia, kenamorphophobia, Ken, kenamorphophobia, I don't know how to pronounce that, um, which is the fear of zombies, um, so, kene pronounces to, um, pronounces, um, translates to movement, I forgot which, I just looked this up, like, literally a minute ago, um, but I forgot where, where, what it, trans, what it, like, comes from, but I know it translates to movement, and then Mordo, that translates to dead. And yeah, so I hate The Walking Dead, but it's kind of weird. It's like, I cower in, in, like, in my bed, just terrified that the next day I'm going to wake up and there's going to be a zombie apocalypse. Um, uh, but it's, it's, it's weird because, like, any zombies in video games is not as scary. 
it's just not as horrific. It's because it's, it looks more digital and fake rather than the terrifying monstrosities we have on movies and TV. Um, sorry, I keep adjusting it because the cord moves it around sometimes. Uh, Alright, so, uh, on number one, Chilipodophobia. I don't even know how to pronounce that. It is the fear of centipedes. Yeah. I honestly don't know how anyone's not terrified of those things. They're just horrific. I don't even... Why do they even exist? Like, seriously. They're literally monsters of nature. And I don't care if they're small or not. I don't care if they can't hurt me. I just... If I ever see one, I will never sleep again. Like, seriously. I will never sleep again. It's just, and don't, like, play around with me by, uh, like, by posting them in the comments. Oh, can you block commenters? I wonder if you can. Um, but seriously, don't, don't do that. It's just cool. And, uh, yeah. So, even the word disgusts me. <sighs> uh... And that was it. If you guys enjoyed this video of me telling me about my fear fears, it wasn't really all that bad until I mentioned the scenty word. Anyways, so like, comment, and subscribe, and tell me if you want to see more vlogs like this. Like maybe like my favorite foods. I don't know, just whatever you want. I don't know. Something I'd be okay with, you know. Not something inc incredibly either stupid. I'm not. I'm not saying that I'm guaranteeing someone's going to do this, but you know, just in case you just like are just gonna troll me in the comments about that, please don't. Um. And I will see you guys in the next video. Yay, bye. Why are you still here? Seriously, why?